Hi, I'm Frank Delane, and I played the teenage Tom Riddle in Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince. Without a doubt, Voldemort is the unchallenged master of the dark arts and the most feared wizard of his age. And yet he also remains shrouded in mystery. We know that in his relentless pursuit of power and invincibility, the Dark Lord has sought out many kinds of strange and unnatural dark magic. Take Horcruxes, which were created when a portion of the soul is broken off and stored in an object in an attempt to achieve immortality. A ring, for example, or a book? While any item can be made into a Horcrux, the Dark Lord often chose to use objects of great historical importance. One such object was Salazar Slytherin's locket. The heavy gold locket has a dark and tangled history behind it. While Slytherin was the original owner, over the years the locket changed hands many times before eventually being stolen by Tom Riddle. Riddle then transformed it into a Horcrux when he murdered a muggle tramp. Years later, Riddle hid the locket in a cave on the coast, placing many powerful defensive enchantments around it. But the cave was breached by former Death Eater Regulus Black, who took the Horcrux and replaced it with a fake. The real locket was brought to the Black family home at 12 Grimald Place by the house elf creature, where it stayed for many years. 